Hey, what's up? This is Diamond. Um, this is a video in response to um, um, your video about privilege. Um, I don't think that um, transsexuals make the distinction between themselves and cross-dressers as a way to like put down cross-dressers. I think that it's a um, I think that it's a distinction that needs to be made. I don't want, I don't think transsexuals want, and I'm a transsexual, so I don't, I don't want to be perceived as a person that is playing dress up. I don't want to be, um, I don't want the world to look at me and think that I go to work as John and come back home and be Bianca at night. I don't want um, a guy that is interested in dating me to think that one, one, you know, one morning when he comes to visit me, he's gonna see um, Brian with a mustache just because I didn't feel like dressing up that day. That's not what a transsexual is, and I think there needs to be a distinction between that and a crossdresser, so people know the difference. But I don't think that transsexuals make the distinction to separate themselves from the social movement because gays, cross-dressers, transsexuals, um, any kind of intersex, all of that, we all are in the same boat. We all are constantly trying to justify to the mainstream, you know, what we are. So, and to get our rights, to get all of that. So, as far, I don't think we make the dis distinction to separate ourselves from the movement of, you know, trying to make some change happen, I think that the, 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 the distinction that's being made is to, you know, so the people looking at the community know that this is what a transsexual is, this is what a crossdresser is, this is what a hermaphrodite is, this is what, you know, a gay male is, you know, this is different, there's a difference between this is what a top is, this is what a bottom is, you know, there's a difference between each and every one of us and they need to know that that this is a vast community don't they don't they already put us all in one box whether we're a crossdresser transsexual drag queen or whatever they put us all in one box they think we're all the same thing and we're not we need to make the distinction so they know that there's a difference between all of us um, you know but it doesn't mean that one is better than the other it's just that's what this particular one chose to be like um, I am one of, I, you know, I'm one of those people that, I guess it would be kind of hypocritical, but sometimes when I see cross-dressers, sometimes I get like a, I don't really say anything because, you know, I know that's stupid. Come on now. You're a transsexual. <laughs> Why would you say anything? Um, but in my mind... Honestly, I would have to say, sometimes I really feel embarrassed. I feel, just being honest, um, embarrassed. I feel like, oh my God, what are you doing? Because I feel like if you're going to come out as a woman, you shouldn't have a, I think you made, I think you made the point about a beard. You shouldn't have a beard if you're dressing like a woman. Um, I think you should at least try to be passable. Of course, everybody does not want surgery. Everybody doesn't want to take hormones and take the risk of having surgeries and doing all that type of stuff. But, you know, at least shave your beard. Come on now. You know, at least dress normally. I know some people that cross-dress and they have, you know, stripper heels about this tall on, fishnets and red boas and wigs pulled down here. It's... You know what I'm saying? It's just, come on. You got, At least try try to be passable as close as possible. You know, it's just, you know, sometimes it's just, it's kind of embarrassing. But, you know, I, that's what they choose to do. So it's kind of like, I, I, I know that in my brain, but I feel when I see it, I'm just like, wow, you know, that's a little much. What if, you know, and then, the, then when you see somebody pointing at you and laughing at you, yeah. Yeah, you know, you should be able to do what you want to do, but it's like, what do you expect? You know, people are ignorant. So, 
I mean, you didn't shave your beard, so they know you're a dude, <laughs> just like a woman. So they're gonna, you know, they're gonna be human and be shady and be ignorant. That's their normal thing. Um, so I, I sometimes I think like they should um, try to be a little bit more passable. Um, but you know, back to the subject. I think that you know we make the distinction not to put cross dresses down, but to um, you know, but to let people know that this is what we are. You know, this is how we live. This is not dress up. This is not. This is a lifestyle. This is. This is how we live. And you know, that's my opinion on that.